Hello. I want to introduce a little instrument to you that can save humankind from extinction. At least help with that. This is the uh, refractometer and it's me measuring what is called bricks, uh, the sugar content uh, in fruits but also in leaves. And if we measure a leaf for its content of uh, sugar, we can see if the, the soil is good uh, and uh, if this soil is regenerated in water, we can see if this uh, soil is helping us to keep healthy. Uh, the operation of the uh, unit is pretty simple. Uh, you simply put some uh, juice of um, a leaf or a fruit on uh, this um, optical device, uh, some drops on there, you cover it, make sure no, no air in there, and then um, you can um, look um, through to the sunlight and you get a reading for the sugar content. You need to take the right type of refractometer, there are many. This is one uh, 0 to 20 percent sugar, so that's a range for the leaf. If you want to uh, compare fruit, um, you may want to have a scale that goes up higher. Uh, there is something that is called bricks farming, and that is that uh, with this um, refractometer, uh, you compare the leaf uh, sugar uh, content, and with that, if you get over 12, what is pretty difficult to achieve, you can see, okay, I'm on a good way to restore the soils and to get to healthy conditions. And um, I was traveling here through southern France and uh, a region uh, that I really love. And uh, I see it with different eyes today than back in the time when I did my bicycle tours there. And now I see a eroded landscape that is still beautiful, but it's lacking uh, biodiversity and the soils are very weak and so the water regeneration doesn't work. Uh, drought and flooding is, uh, well, always happening. And so if we really look at uh, the, well, quality of the soil through this, so we can, uh, actually we can, we can see the quality of soil this way so it's a it's an amazing way to do it and uh, so we could encourage uh, farmers and gardeners to improve uh, their soil with regenerative agriculture and with this you can really see uh, if it works and if it's going uh, the right direction this well partly very barren land in southern France and many other parts of the world uh, it mustn't be barren. Uh, we can restore this. So what you see uh, behind me is uh, sort of just shrubs and it is a uh, wonderful um, weather condition. So there could be, uh, well, lush forests growing. There could be uh, food forests. There could be agroforestry done and, um, well, different types of, of gardening. Uh, and so that could lift the region out of uh, poverty because the actual production of uh, mostly uh, grape for wine production is not very high income stuff and well we don't need to produce that many drugs we can produce uh, excellent food and that will bring a lot more income and can restore the soils so well that's uh, something that is um, may maybe not uh, so interesting for those organizations, people, politicians, NGOs profiting from the problems because we can solve the problem simply and uh, the prob problem profiteurs they are uh, of course uh, so busy in uh, profiting from the problems that they oversee the simple solutions. Thank you.